Hey guys, welcome to my new After Effects beginner video. In this video, I will show to make this animation with After Effects. Let's get started. So guys, welcome back and first of all, select this layer 1 and go to pen behind. Move the anchor point down and click tool. Then select this layer 2, go to pen behind and also move the anchor point down classification tool and layer 3 go to pen behind and move the anchor point down classification tool and select layer 1 let's put here and layer 3 and layer 2 so so guys do you want to convert video or record screen your desktop Maybe video enhancer. Wondershare Uniconverter is the best choice for you. Uniconverter supporting 1000 plus video and audio formats. Are you gamer or teacher? Screen recorder tool is the best way for you. Want to enhance video? Use AI video enhancer tool. DVD burn video editor, space to text and more in Wondershare Uniconverter. For now, let's select these layers and hide. Select this bank layer and let's go to first second, press P and move it down. Let's enable title action save. Make new pass in QFrame and go to 10 QFrames. For shortcut you can use hold shift, press page down in keyboard and let's move it up. Go to 10 QFrames again, move it down, again 10 QFrames moved up again 10 q frames moved it down and again moved up and again moved it down so there are more q frames for bones animation select these q frames make easy or click f9 let's animation okay so select all q frames right mouse and q frame interpolation change auto bezier to linear click ok Okay, so in this time, go to here and make new pass in Q frame and go to 10 Q frames, move to up. And select Q frame, move to right, go to graph editor. Let's zoom to graph and select this Q frame, move to right, and last Q frame, move to left. Okay, back to Q frames. And here, let's go to shape layers, hold this icon. Select ellipse tool and let's go to here and hold alt make one ellipse like this and select this shape layer move to behind bank layer and let's move to center like this okay so in this time go to here and press s make scale Q frame and let's link to shape layer to bank layer and go to here change scale for full screen Select two frames, make easy. Let's see. Okay, and select two frames, go to graph editor, select this graph, let's make smooth animation and select work area. Okay, not bad. Select last two frames, move right for more slow animation and go to graph editor, let's zoom to graph and select these last few frames, move to left okay back to two frames and right now let's enable these layers and move to right okay and go to here, press P, make new pass in two frames and go to back, select layer 1, move to left Select layer 2, move to down, and layer 3, move to right, and select two frames, make easy. Okay, let's move to left for better timing. Select two frames, go to graph editor, and select this graph. Let's move to left. Okay, not bad. Back to two frames and select this layer two. 
move to right and layer 3 move to right okay that's good so let's go to here select this bank layer hold shift press air open rotation make rotation keyframe change minus 25 and go to here change 15 and go to 10 keyframes change minus 7 go to again 10 keyframes change 3 that 5 and next keyframe minus 1 that 5 and next keyframe change 0 that 5 and next keyframe change 0 again I want to say we have more keyframes for realistic bones and dynamic animation Select two frames, make easy. Okay, that's good. So let's go to window, open animation composer 3, and go to starter precoms and shape elements. And I want to use first these particle fireworks and click add and let's see let's move to the left okay not bad select this bank layer and go to first second hold shift press s open scale click d second and Make sketch you frame change scale like this 125 or 150 and move to down a little bit. Go to 10 you frames, change 95. Go to again 10 you frame, change 115. Again 10 you frames, 98. And next you frame, change 100%. And make you frames easy. okay looks good so let's select these two frames move to left move to left more and select these layers move to left also okay very nice so I want to add expression for these loop animations. Let's press air open rotation and hold alt. Let's click this time icon and wiggle to nine. Let's see, select work area. Okay, pretty good. And let's copy expression, select this. Press Air, hold Alt, click this time icon, Control V. Let's change this six. Okay, and finally select this layer one. Press Air, hold Alt, click here, Control V, change five. Okay, not bad. So guys, thank you for watching my video and don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like video and please follow me on Instagram. Good luck!